I think if you're experiencing mental ill health or emotional distress, it's a really difficult step sometimes going to a GP and then very often there might not be very much available for you. So I think you know, from that perspective, you know, it's just it's massively important to start investing properly in mental health services. My name's Jane Yendall, I'm Service Director for Adult Mental Health and Learning Disabilities within Somerset Partnership. Parity of esteem and between mental health and physical health services is enormously important and I think this project is one step along the way to achieving that parity of esteem. All sectors within Somerset came together to write it. We wrote it together with lived experience of our services, our recovery partners. We sat with the local authority, with the clinical commissioners, as well as the voluntary sector. So it felt like for the first time, there was an enormously important kind of ethos of in Somerset, we're in this together to make a difference to our population. This funding is very much around breaking down traditional barriers, breaking down stigma, ensuring that the service user goes to their GP, that the GP is able to think both about their physical and mental and emotional health. I think it will be great for staff because it will be a service that provides a great deal more variety and a lot more opportunities across Somerset. There's a lot more roles within the bid for qualified staff such as nurses, psychologists, allied health professions, staff that are an enormously important part of our support workforce, so assistant psychologists and support workers and peer support workers, as well as opportunities for people that are graduating, so I think it's a great opportunity. It won't be one place. We're hoping that it will be a mental health ethos that will kind of spread across Somerset um, and within people's communities. Mm -hmm.